Hi beautiful people, I am back with an unboxing, it's a, <laughs> it's a really big one, if I'm not mistaken this comes uh, from Royal Diamond Painting, so because I'm not sure I'm not gonna um, tell you when I got this and when I ordered it because I will put all that in the description box because I'm not sure but I believe it's royal diamond painting so what did I get the, the drills I will show you the drills afterwards and welcome to my channel Anyway, hope you all are all staying safe. Oh my god, so much drills. It's a big one. I'm <laughs> fighting with the box. Never mind, so many drills. Three packets of drills. <gasps> oh my god. That's really a big one. So, okay. I don't see... Yeah, I see... Uh, Sorry, I'm gonna let my cat inside. So, the one I ordered is um, with squares. I will take this out first of all. So many drills. Oh my god. So, and it has lots of colors oh my god 89 colors and the name is Chinese tiger and yeah I don't know yeah you know I like tigers but I don't know what's it about this image that really yeah the tiger is really fierce and there's like this red ball uh, behind him and a like a mandala thing type of thing I really love this image so and I thought yeah for good details I'm gonna pick a big one 80 by 80 but I never thought it would be with so many colors and apparently they already did the checking of the packages for me so to make sure i will double check of course but normally when it's already checked you should have all the drills you need and that's what i call service thank you so much for this royal diamond painting now i'm very curious if there are a bees in this one but as far i as i can tell from the dmc numbers there is none but you know me I'm gonna enhance it anyway and I will use the drills that I have, the AB drills, which stands for Aurora Borealis and it means that there's an extra iridescent coating on your drills. So that's what I will be using and if I have some colors, uh, I need some other colors, I will go over to Diamond Painting with Sparklers and uh, get me some other because I have all the DMC numbers, that's all I need. Very good. So, the toolkit. This is a very sturdy bag. You get the pointy tweezers. Be very careful, these are very sharp, so always put the sleeve back on. You get some baggies. I doubt this will be enough to <laughs> keep 89 colors but yeah two big plates of wax and this is actually good type of wax because it's a little bit see-through but it's not as transparent as the other types of pink waxes so this is actually very good wax so two plates of that small boat I hope they have at least a multi-placer and yes they have a pen with a squishy it's like this um, sparkly type of pen but they have a tree placer 
but it's the the broad one it's not a small one so i'm not going to use this i'm going to replace this with a four placer and four squares yeah this one this one could work with rounds but for squares these are not really the type you need now let's get into the painting i'm gonna put this away very quickly boom, 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 boom. I really love the image. Um, scissors. Scissors. They taped it and it's poured glue. And that's, uh, I believe, on the side of Royal Diamond Painting. And this is um, this kind of tape that's easy to remove. Uh, on the side of Diamond Painting, you can choose if you want poured glue or double sided adhesive. And that's something that I really really like about Royal Diamond painting because yes some people do prefer um, double-sided adhesive strangely enough I asked for poured glue because I'm I'm a drill shifter if you know what I mean I shift my drills sometimes from place to place because I'm someone who sometimes misplaces drills we're not gonna talk about that, <laughs> but it's poured glue, so what I can do is roll it. You can only do this with poured glue, guys, you already know. And look, it comes in a noodle, so that's a plus, so points for that. So whenever you're working on it, you can uh, roll it up. But then roll it with the diamonds outwards, very uh, important, because otherwise the diamonds would pop. Oh my god, I don't even have to roll it really hard, because it's already... <gasps> Look at that. I'm gonna try to get you out of the business a little bit, because... Oops! Fainting camera. Very sorry. <laughs> so, it's a big one. 80 by 80. I don't know what I'm always thinking. I always want the big ones. And then I'm thinking, why do I want the big ones? Because I'm not going to hang them all in my house. And um, maybe the tiger I would. The canvas is not soft, but it's a... Uh, I can feel it's really like a quality canvas. It's a little bit cut, like wonky, but I don't mind. There's a legend on the side, on one side. But I don't mind because this will be a beautiful one. And I absolutely love the colors. So the colors of the tiger and the red. And the canvas, it's a little bit dark to um, be honest. So I don't really know about a symbol clear clarity. I'll try to show you, please. Uh, so it's a little bit dark. So this, the symbols are clear, but this will have to be worked on with a light pad, I'm sure, because this without a light pad I would have troubles so I'm gonna turn it around a little bit so you can check the flower that's behind him oh, that's so gorgeous I really love this I don't know what it's about but like these these clouds here it's typically like shine Chinese and his paw and then there's the fire like it's a really fierce tiger yeah so that's the canvas gonna turn it backwards to show you the drills i'm gonna so about the drills at first glance i don't see anything wrong with the drills but they come in such a small packages that's something I really don't like and I hope they're numbered so I hope you don't mind I'm not gonna take them all out of the bags but I will show you the 310 
to make sure that the quality of the drills is there. Of course, <clears throat> you cannot really make sure before... Oh my god, is that all 310? Oh. <laughs> oh my god! No. Oh, phew. Oh my. <sighs> it's not all 310, but... This is all 310. Look at this. But they're all little small bags, so I will put them in just a really big boat and let's see how many bags of 310 we have. <laughs> 77 bags of 310. But luckily I have some 310 AB, so maybe I might just to change a little bit, I might put some other um drills down ABs so and then I've got the other package with the dark ones is 939 and I've got um, how many of this where is it 42 so yeah that's really lots of dark but as you see the background of the tiger there is lots of darkness going on behind him, so yeah, I will have to live with it. So, let's check the quality. So, I don't know if you can see it, but I cannot really move them around because it's really, like, tight. So I cannot move the drills around very much to show you, but as I can see, I can see no dimples and maybe here and there I can see a little knobbly bit, but at first glance I don't see many trash. I see a good quality drills. So. We will have to wait before I start on this to make sure that they are good drills and not popping drills. But as far as I've seen um, videos on Royal Diamond painting, I must say, please focus here, focus here, come on, come. As far as I can tell, uh, most videos I've seen about Royal Diamond painting there, um, Drills are good quality, I think. So, that's another tiger I'm going to tackle. Um, so, I'm going to show you the painting one more time. One, two, three. There he is, the fierce tiger. I really love it. He reminds me of my, of my husband when he gets out of bed. <laughs> my husband is also a tiger, as am I. So, <laughs> he looks like that when he wakes up. Yeah. Lovely. So, um, I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna change the camera view. And I'm quickly going to show you um, how I'm doing with my uh, Josephine wall that I'm doing right now. And I will give you some uh, things to um, think about. Because there were some persons, a uh, subscriber of mine, you know who you are. She said she wanted to take on the challenge as well. So this would be great if there were other subscribers that will say yeah hell I'm gonna tackle a Josephine wall as well so just for those people and for everyone that watches this video of course I'm gonna show you what I'm doing how um, things you should uh, watch out for and um, so let me turn this camera around and I will see you back in a few minutes so hi um, why do I always say see you in a few minutes before? Because for you it's a blink of an eye. An eye. But anyway, so this is the 
part I've done so or uh, I've done already. So it's one, two, three, four squares that I've done, and I will try with all my <laughs> editing skills. I will try to show you a picture of the area of the painting I'm um, doing right now. So I will try to put this up in here somewhere. Um, so I'm using this. It's a magnifying glass. I believe I got it from Amazon, if I'm not mistaken. It wasn't expensive at all. So, before you tackle a painting like this, please make sure that you have one of these. Because some of the symbols are really, really unclear. And it pains me to say it because I love this painting and I love the quality of the drills. It's phenomenal. Phenomenal. But uh, yeah, the symbols sometimes gave me a headache. So I started working with this has got LED lights. Oh, sorry, <laughs> has got LED lights on the bottom and you have got like this thing that magnifies even more. So sometimes I put this down real close to see if it's the symbol I need. So that's what I'm working with. So this is really a must if you want to do a painting with so many colors because you see the drills are really nicely snug together but that means that the the there are no training wheels but the symbols are sometimes really a pain in the yeah you know because some symbols um wait i will try to show you um, like this. So first tip that I have for you is if you have your containers, make sure that you really put your bottles or your little uh, container thing is that you put them always with the number like this, because as you can see, these symbols are the same. Even the color is, it's not exactly the same color, but it's like a little bit different, but the symbol is the same. So unless you've got very good eyesight and you can see your colors very well, you have to watch out for these things. So always put them with on the right side up with the number downwards. So you don't mistake, uh, you make no mistakes with um, symbols like this. And there are some in this uh, package because, yeah, 325 colors, what do you have to do? It's a lot. So, yeah. So that's my first tip. Second tip is when you take out a container and you're like, blah, 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 I'm going to put some, like, I'm going to show you the quality of the drills. The quality they're really great i think they're a tad smaller actually than your normal um drills but the quality there's no trash nowhere nowhere it's, it's really so but sometimes i put drills in my tray and accidentally i put this away and then i say oh my god what was i working on I can't remember the number or the symbol and then I'm like, okay, I have to pick my brain. And so that's something you should really be careful about. If you work on it, leave your container next to your drills so that you don't forget which color you're working on. Don't put it back in the, <laughs> because Sometimes I do it like an automatism. I pour it out, I put it back, and I, th I think, oh my god, no, I don't remember. So that's something you should be very careful about. Also, another tip. Come on, come out, please. Thank you. So another tip I have is like when you see a symbol and... Um, 
you're like, hmm, I only need one or two of this one, don't put it out in the tray. Just take the little container and when you put it under the, yeah, sometimes it's, it's, it's like, yeah, but that's something you will have to accept that sometimes you're bumping against your but I put it under the and, and I just work out of the bottle and I take one and like I put it down so that's much more easy and then I just put it away and take another one um, another tip I don't know if wait I will try to get you a little bit closer to the symbols so that you can see for yourself so you see what I mean so now I've done most of the the darker symbols already so choose a symbol that you say I'm, I'm gonna recognize this very easy so let's say that for example we would do um, this this striped symbol here uh, here or you would do this is a paint roller so always take a symbol that really comes out and and tackle them first and then later on you do the symbols that are not so clear so like uh, just please focus. Focus. Okay, like now oh, this hand, this hand here. Okay, that's clear, clear enough. But there's one symbol like this one. That's not so clear. So wait with those symbols. First, take the ones that are really visible visible and then tackle the other ones so and wherever you can like here there might be some spots you can multi-place because the rest of the painting will all be single placing because it's really confetti heavy um i think that's about everything i wanted to tell you so that's my first the first experiences i had and so far i'm really liking it i was afraid that i would burn myself out quickly with this but actually i really enjoy even with this the 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 glass i really enjoy this because yeah i don't know what it is it just gives me like this feeling i'm like doing something very very special and it's fun to see those drills in really there they look very big and i don't know what there's something about this process i really love so i don't know maybe this will change whenever i get to um, further in this painting and um yeah that's maybe another tip if you feel like you're burning yourself out give yourself a break and tackle something really small like um this is do you rem remember from a previous video i did an unboxing of fg normal so there was this tiger um what is it called something to put in between your books we say bladwijzer but yeah your English so <laughs> or another language so um, this is what I do sometimes in between um, my my drills are a bit wonky and I'm so sorry to say this one is still sold out on the side but they have got lots of lovely lovely uh, bookmarks that it's bookmarks they have got millions of yeah millions it's exaggerated but they've got many bookmarks and they've got bookmarks with uh special drills so do something like that in between so that you're not burning yourself out because that's not the point of doing this craft isn't it it's about relaxing and yeah as this is growing and i can see some of the shapes and I recognize it from the picture. I really like, hmm, I really like this. So, 
that's it for me for now. So I'm very pleased to say I really love this and that some maybe some of my subscribers might take on the same challenge. I would love to hear your um, experiences. Just reach out to me. I will put every detail in my description. If you want to see more videos like this, you can subscribe to me and you can hit the bell to be notified anytime I put up a video or a review or anything. And so I want to thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a really great day. Thank you so much. Bye guys.